Hello everybody, welcome to Uprising 144 Cam Hydrogen Man. So guys, I got a very interesting story for you today. Before I begin, I am not giving you any medical advice. I am not making any medical claims. And with that being said, it's actually an interesting story about one of my brothers. I didn't even know. He recently contacted me. He's almost 60 years old. Uh, and he apparently found out that he's got kidney disease. And not just like kidney disease, like he's just about to get on dialysis. Apparently he was at stage four. Stage five, by that point you have to get on dialysis. And he contacted me, he's like, do you really think the hydrogen thing will work for me? And of course, I spent a ton of time with him, you know, told him, hey, get the clean water. Uh, there's a really great website called mypurewater.com or myaquanui.com. I have discount codes for both, which is Uprising144K. I don't know if you have to capitalize all the letters or not, but this is what I recommended for him based on what I would do for me. Of course, he got on the hydrogen, a few suggestions about foods. And that's pretty much it, you know, do a lot of the, I have a specific water protocol, a specific inhalation protocol, and of course the best device to use that's the safest for kidneys. I don't want to use anything toxic, nothing that uses chemicals to make the hydrogen, anything of that nature, because that's been coming up a lot. People keep asking about stuff like Brown's gas. I would definitely not use that if you're having kidney issues. Um, you want pure hydrogen. And of course, you guys know that I prefer the Japanese machine, the Hydrofix. So this is what he did. I think it's been about two months, roughly. I just heard from him the other day, and apparently he has dropped, his doctor told him that this was a chronic disease. You cannot reverse kidney, you know, basically kidney issues or these type of kidney problems. He's saying you can't reverse this kidney damage. Lo and behold, it's been reversed already to some extent. It's gone to stage three, which is already remarkable. He was also suffering from high blood pressure. Interesting now, of course, they put him on medication to try to control it. He gets on the hydrogen. And as I always tell people, watch your blood pressure when you get on hydrogen, because if you're on medications, what ends up happening is it ends up falling too low. And that's exactly what happened to him. So they're already having to back off the medications, which was not only very impressive, I'm already aware that it's impressive, but I've seen it so many times, it doesn't surprise me much these days. But you know, most doctors, nurses are so surprised because normally you always have to increase medications with time, not get rid of them. In this case, he's having to lower it, lower it significantly and I believe that he will basically get off of it in time. He's also borderline diabetic. We'll see where that goes. But this is a very interesting testimony and maybe at some point I'll do a video, maybe do an interview with him or something of that nature because he was skeptical. Um, I didn't even know that he had these issues till he reached out to me. Uh, very interesting story. I'll keep you guys posted if you want to. Make sure to comment below if you guys want me to continue to keep you guys posted on such things. Don't forget to support the channel by giving the video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to share guys. A lot of people out there are suffering from whether it's blood pressure, whether it's kidney problems, you know, whether it's borderline diabetes and people don't know, even doctors don't know about this amazing technology, you know, about hydrogen and even the science behind it, which is there's tons of it guys. So we need to share this information. We need to get it out there. I appreciate everybody's help. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time on the next one.